Hello, I'm James Clark from the Department of Physiology at King's College London. And in this very short tutorial, I'm just going to show you how you can remove the start and end of a video using Handbrake. So I've got a video on my desktop. It's an MP4 file downloaded from Zoom. If I view it on my computer screen, you'll see that the first few minutes are simply the administrators and colleagues chatting. And the actual lecture itself, the bit we want to show to the outside world, doesn't start until 5 minutes and 5 seconds. So we'll make a note of that. And if we scroll to the end of the video, we'll see that again there's a little bit of chat as the video closes before people actually leave the call. So the last 12 seconds we want to lose. So we've got a start at 5 minutes and 5 seconds and the end at 56 minutes and 53 seconds. So we close Take that care. down. We then drop this recording into handbrake. We've already set up our handbrake compression so we don't need to worry about that when we convert our video. But what we're really interested in now is this section up the top here that says range. Rather than choosing different chapters, we're going to choose different seconds. Although it says seconds, it really means hours, minutes and seconds. So in the windows next to this, we can see 00, zero colon 00, zero colon 00. zero. And that corresponds to the time we want the video to start, which we know is 5 minutes and 5 seconds. And we're going to cut this video off at 56 minutes and 57 seconds. Now you'll see the duration of the video has been reduced from 58 minutes down to 51 minutes. And if I now click on start and encode this video, it will encode this video removing the first 5 minutes and 5 seconds from the start so the lecture starts at the right time and removing the last minute or so from the end so there's no hand waving or logging off. So this is a very quick way once you've recorded a lecture either using Teams or using Zoom when you've downloaded it to your local computer you can trim the start and ending off your video before uploading it for students or colleagues to view.